what it feels like to be complete truly truly <laughs> okay so I guess you could say this is one of those moments where I feel like holy moly so there's my mirror and my soon-to-be white wall. In fact, I think I shall do it this evening. And... light box coming from the bottom. I think the mirror should be higher. No, the mirror is a good height. So yeah, that's what I spent the better part of uh, the last two days doing. And I'm glad to say that uh, my mirror is quite the success. Let's see. Hmm. Like for real, for real really makes the bathroom seem much bigger than it really is <laughs> okay well that's it folks um, volume 5 yes I'm sweating bullets as you can see and uh, one more thing accomplished so till next time ta -ta. oh I took a bunch of photos of renovations since this is only two minutes and Twenty two seconds long. Some fun stuff to visualize. See you next time. And so and so let's do this. Nothing like some visuals of the workspace. in and around surroundings. <laughs> that is some trim for my cupboards. I'm going with the open concept. That's a shelf I made. You shall see it in action later. Yes, all that stuff will be used for something cool. Jewish granny chairs in the background there that my buddy pointed out. He's like, yeah, that's from the 90s. <laughs> Garbage day is Thursday, don't worry. All that, bye-bye. Not that. That's for the next creative project. Recycle is the key. I'll give you a million dollars if you can tell me what those red things are. <laughs> Voila. Circa 1970s. Walkie talkies. Circa 1930s. Antique clock that still works. The shelf that was, you gotta measure twice, cut once, that's the rule. And she's always looking. That ubiquitous glare, ubiquitous gaze from a mysterious woman.
yeah, there you have it. There you have it, ladies and gentlemen. So, see you next time.